This is an exercise of marketing. That's all it is because if, if you read every press release today that goes out in the marketplace and you'll see the next billion dollar project being announced and then you look at the date of which they're delivering it and, and you say, well, what happens between now and that date? Well, there's a couple things that happens. Technology changes, the, the hardware itself changes, and they're, they're not building the data centers that are being built today are not the data center of tomorrow. So our solution to all those problems were a data center that was not constrained by power. So it didn't matter if the rack, the rack plug-in was 10 kW, 20 kW, 100 kW, 1000 kW. We didn't care. We designed it so you could move pieces in and out and it didn't matter how technology changed. That was the first part. The next part was how fast could we build something and deliver it? And when we realized we could go under a year, that was the next key component. And then the last part is if you kind of listen to, you know, the echo chambers of government saying, listen, utility locations are going to be the place data centers are going to have to partner with because you can't build the infrastructure to the actual grid system fast enough to solve for it. And what we did was we went right to the utility and said, you have locations that I know you're not using all the power. 